Now, just a few general fine tuning tips before I move to a demo. Spend 80 or 90% plus of your time on data preparation. That probably means uh, watching some of the other videos. Second of all, define two evaluation data sets. One is a representative data set that's not in your training set. I explained in my data prep video how you can rephrase certain questions in order to make sure they're not verbatim in your training and your eval set. But I do, I do recommend including a verbatim copy of some of your training data set because by including a verbatim copy and also a version, a data set that's not in your training set, you can start to measure the difference in performance between these two and assess whether you are overfitting. Measuring overfitting is another reason to use the eval set during training. So you should be calculating training and eval losses. Make sure to evaluate before and after fine tuning. Um, and then one kind of random tip here is do inspect the chat template being used when you're fine tuning. Some chat templates have got the date included with them. And if they have the date, you probably don't want to be fine tuning on today's date for all of your examples. Uh, so you may want to remove that uh, when you're doing the fine tuning. Uh, so other things that can appear unexpectedly may also uh, adversely affect the quality.